Hello friends, here I am from Planning Coaching Classes. Today's session is about to find the square of any given number. Tina, let's see how it will be possible uh, within 5 seconds. Within 5 seconds, if you want to find out the square of any given number from 30 to 99. My dear friends, if you find out the square from 30 to 99 square, think now. You have to know about square from 11 square to 30 square. If you know square from 11 square to 30 square, then it's a very easy to find square from 30 to 99 square. How it could be possible within 5 seconds? Let's see. Let's take an example. Let's take an example 32. If we have to find out the square of 32, my dear friends, it's very easy. Let's see. Here unit there is 2, tens plus is 9. First part is done. Here square the unit number. Unit number is 2. Here unit number is 2. So we have to square of 2. That is 4. That is 4. But we can't return 4 as a single unit. We have to return 0, 4. We have to return 0, 4. Why? Because square of 2 digit number. Square of 2 digit number that is equal to 4 digit number. That is equal to 4 digit number. So we have to unit square that is equal to 2 square. And we have to write not 4, we have to write 0, 4 only. Let's see, 10 digit, 10 digit is 3, is square of 3, that is equal to 9, that is equal to 9. Now, that is the first step, that is the first step. Second step is that, unit number is 2, test number is 3, you have to multiply both numbers. You have to multiply both numbers, that is equal to 6, that is equal to 6. Let's see one more time, given number is 32. Think now, you have to scale unit number that is equal to 2. If you scale of unit number is a single unit, if it is a single unit, then you have to write not a 4, you have to write 0 4. If it is a double digit, then not an issue regarding that. Think now, if it is a single digit, you have to write 0 4 only. Think now. Now, second step, multiplying both numbers, that is 3 into 2, that is equal to 6. Think now. now Double the multiplication. Now double the multiplication. That is equal to 6 to the 12. That is equal to 12. Now 904. <coughs> 904. Multiplication is 1, 2. Multiplication is 1, 2. Now what can I do? Now what can I do? <coughs> Let's see. We are separating the units. Why? Here we see 1 square that is equal to 1, 2 square that is equal to 4, 3 square that is equal to 9, 4 square that is equal to 16, 5 square that is equal to 25, 6 square that is equal to 36, 7 square that is equal to 49, 8 square that is equal to 64, 9 square that is equal to 81, and 10 square that is equal to 100. Now, what we see over here? We see only scaling 1, we get the number 1 at a unit plus. Same as case in 11. If we are scaling 11 square, if we are scaling 11, then what can we 1 as a unit plus. If we go to the 21 square, what can we see? 1 square, that is equal to 1. Now, 2 is square, if we are scaling 2, what can I get? 4. 4 at a unit plus. Take now. If we go through the 12 square, what can I get in the unit place? 4. If we go through the 20 square, what can I get in the unit place? 4. That is also 4. That means, first number do not be changed. That's why you have to separate. Now, what can I do? Our product is 12. Our product is 12. Think now. Write in over here. 2 and 1. And simply add 4 as it is 2 and 1. 
That is the answer. My dear friends, that is the first time. That's why taking so much time. Think about it. I have explained whole thing over here. That's taking time. That why, that's why it is taking time over here. If we go to directly, think about it. Let's take another example. Uh, I will look. Mm, let's take another example. <clears throat> another example is that uh, taking 32 square. Now, no need to write the whole process over here. You have to write only numbers. Think now. Uh, for example, sorry, sorry. Next example, sorry, sorry. 34. What can I do? Scaling of unit is it? That is equal to 4. 4 plus square, 16. Tan is it? That is equal to 3. Scaling of 3, that is equal to 9. Now, what can I do? 4 3 is up to a double the product that is equal to 12 is up. What did I write? 24. Now, separating the unit with this. Now, separating the unit with this. Put a 24 over here and simply add 6, 4, 1, 5, 9, 2, 5. That is the answer. Let's take another example 36. Is carrying the unit number 6 that is equal to 36. Is carrying the tens number. 3 that is equal to 9 product that is equal to id and twice the power product that is equal to 36 and simply put up the 36 over here and simply add 6, 6, 3, 9, 9, 3, 12 that is the answer <coughs> hmm. now take another example uh, what about the 45 what about the scale of 45 note the 45 a number on which in which unit place is 5. What did I do? It's very simple. 45 into 45, 5 times are 25, and just add 1 to any number that is equal to 5, and that is equal to 5 for the 20. That is a scale of 2025 of 45 scale. Let's take another example. For the example, 35. 35. What can I do? 5 pegs are 25, add 1, that is equal to 4, and 4 is a 12. 4 is a 12. That is the answer. Now, let's take another example. Add 7. Add 7. What can I do before? Scale of unit plus 7, that is equal to 49. A square of 10 that is equal to add and a square of 8 that is equal to 64 separating the unit plus what can I do next? 8 7 are 56 and 56 ka twice what is 100 <coughs> right. <coughs> writing over 1 2 over here 2 1 and 1 and just simply add 9 4 2 6 4 1 5 6 1 7 that is the answer so if we go through the traditional method that means uh, we have to go through number of steps and if we go through the, this method then you have to take only 5 to 6 7 think it up uh, and another session we were discussing about the square uh, from 1 0 2 up to 199. Thanks for watching this video.